hey friends welcome or welcome back to another video it is saturday i don't know what the oh october 12th and we are going to do a week in my hair so last night i washed conditioned deep conditioned my hair if you saw the pattern seamer video that is when I did my hair last night. So it is the next day. I just took my braids down. They're still kind of damp. I am not going to separate them just yet. So maybe at the end of the day, I'll come back and show you guys what my hair looks like. But I'm about to be standing outside for I don't know how long. Um, and it's supposed to be about 76 as the high today. So we're going to see how this braid out looks when I come back. But welcome to... A week in my hair okay so ooh, okay so like I kind of promised this is the end of day one I did spend all day outside I was outside from like 8 30 to 2 and I did end up separating my hair I didn't have any oil or anything and these are my results um I forgot to tell y'all what I used to do my braid out I think but um my wash day, you probably saw, but to braid my hair, I used Ajua Bowel Mint Leave-In Conditioner very lightly and the Curl Defining Cream. So yeah, I'm just gonna tie my hair down, pray it doesn't get too smashed. If I feel like I need to re-braid it in the morning, we will talk about it, but Y'all, I'm about to shower and go night night. I will see y'all tomorrow. Okay, it's the next morning. Let's take this scarf off. Oh, it's not as bad as I thought. It just needs a little fluffing. Okay, I'm just gonna keep playing with it. Actually, I'm gonna run and get me some breakfast and keep playing with it and yeah, but not too bad. What does the back look like, though? Easy peasy. I was thinking about rebraiding it, but my nails are terrible. <laughs> Here's what the scalp is looking like. I see flakes already. Day two, so I might, I need to like oil my scalp tonight or something. So, morning, day two. Ooh, well, we're recording. I did not come on here this morning. It's Monday, so this is day three since I started this video. This is what my hair is looking like. I haven't done anything to it. I didn't even sleep with a bonnet on it last night. I just slept on my satin pillowcase. And so, yeah, the definition still there. I think tomorrow I'm going to pull my life together and we are going to take the steamer to it and probably just use a leave-in conditioner and rebraid it. It still feels really good. I don't know. I just really like the way this braid out looks. It wasn't like, it wasn't super perfect, but it just looks like my hair and I just, really like that and also I can tell it's time for a trim when I feel like my hair looks really good like I'm like oh my gosh it's finally growing I know it's time for me to get a trim either way this is my day three check-in hopefully you can see my hair hold on let me close this jewel um so it's Tuesday and this is what my hair is looking like didn't do anything to it of course but tonight we are going to refresh it i'm also about to try and go live so if you joined in with that like i'm recording at the same time so don't judge me so i might not be doing a lot of talking i'm just going to show y'all what i'm going to do to 
refresh my hair using the pattern steamer so let me get that set up actually and let's get this started i'm just going to use audra beauty's bowman leave-in conditioner because it has hold i already have product on my hair and hopefully this thing will just help reactivate it my hair is still my nails are terrible my hair is still so incredibly soft but i just want to see if like we can kind of get rid of some of this frizz and give it like a clean slate. You know what I mean? You know what I mean. All right. So we got the water in it. I still have water in it from last time. And I probably had enough to do this, but I just went ahead and refilled it. Now, I decided to refresh my hair with the steamer for multiple reasons. One, I feel like the warm water, the steam, makes my hair more pliable and easier to manipulate rather than just using water. Water works, but if we can add a little heat to it and open up the cuticle and get some moisture into it, it's like, why not? Two, I feel like I didn't have to use as much water. You know, when you use a spray bottle, it sometimes feel like your hair is saturated. And with this, by using the steamer, I feel like I'm not using as much water. Therefore, my hair took no time to dry. And I just used a little bit of product and the definition is going to come right back, I promise. And also, I really like that I could detangle my hair and also focus on my ends. As you can see, my ends are starting to stick together it's time for a trim and this way I'm not tearing through my hair I'm not fighting with my ends and I can refresh my hair easily it's Wednesday I didn't take my hair down I'm not feeling the best so I'll see y'all tomorrow okay good people it's Thursday evening um I'm just gonna take a pump of the blue Tennessee serum I've already applied it to these braids and we are going to see what this braid out is giving. In all honesty, my scalp is giving me a run for my money. I actually oiled it this morning. I should have oiled it last night, but I was just too tired to do so. I'm going to try and take this first braid down with y'all and then come back and show y'all what it looks like. Just because I don't want this to be a never ending video, but... Oh, look at that definition. Oh, uh, okay. All right, so I'm gonna come back when I have all the braids down. Y'all see this definition? I'm not mad about it. I'm just trying to be gentle as I separate somewhat. There was a reason that I turned this camera on and now that it's on, I really cannot remember what it was. This is, this is pretty much how we are looking if you were on my live, y'all said I was going to have a nice fluffy braid out. I didn't expect it to have this much hole, seeing as how I just used the leave-in. But I really like it. And I think the more I play with it, the better it'll look. I just don't like how it, it looks straight on the ends as soon as I take my hair down. But it will eventually come into place. So yeah, this is my Thursday check in see y'all tomorrow or maybe later tonight we'll see good morning it's friday and this is not how i woke up i've actually been up i went for a run i've been out at the store but before i got in the shower i did want to show y'all what my hair looks like so you know last night all i did was tie it down oh i guess i didn't show y'all that either all i did was tie it down with this scarf like this I didn't put any bonnet or anything on it. I just tied it down. And so this is what Fred is looking like. I like it so much more today than I did yesterday when I took it down. I just, I'm just not the biggest fan of my fresh hair. And I feel like once I get out and moving, once I really shake it out, it will be even better. But yes definition still there y'all saw i had it back in the ponytail um i think the oil that i put on my hair yesterday is just now making its way down my strands because i didn't put any more product on it and it looks better it has more of a shine than it did yesterday so i definitely recommend if you are oiling your scalp <laughs> do that at night but i feel like y'all already know that and i feel like this serum actually had time to kind of like melt into my hair but 
Fred is soft. He's not stiff. My ends feel good. And yeah, I'm probably going to wash my hair tonight, but I will come back and show y'all what it looks like at the end of my work day and once I've been out and running errands. But yes, a week in my hair continues. Well guys, it's Friday night. This is what my hair looked like after the end of the day. I am too lazy to wash my hair, so I will wash it tomorrow, but we are going to end this video here. Um, I don't have anything else to say. I just feel like my hair still looks pretty good. And if my scalp wasn't so itchy, I would probably let this continue for a few more days. But we've got to get into color prep. So I do have like two more wash days that I need to <laughs> add into my routine before next Friday. So thank you guys so much for watching. I truly appreciate each and every one of you. And I'll see you really, really soon.